Thanks again for tuning in. My name is Stephanie Figuera with Hexagon TV, and today we have Jose Luis Peinado from Luciad with us today to talk about how the company plays a role in the Hexagon family. Thanks again very much for joining us today. So, who is Luciad? Luciad is a company that delivers uh, geospatial software solutions for mission critical environments. We provide a complete suite with server, desktop, browser, and web solutions that allow the users to create uh, amazing geospatial applications to visualize and analyze huge amounts of data in real time. All right. And why is Luciad called a 5D company? Well, uh, in the beginning, geospatial systems only included 2D and database static data. Then 3D was added to it. After that, it became possible to include real-time information from sensors, traffic, weather. It's what we call the fourth dimension. It is the fact that we can display moving data. But Lucid doesn't stop at just visualizing data. We want our users to gain insight from their information. This is what we call the fifth dimension of our products. We offer a platform plus solution templates for 5D experience that goes from the data capture all the way down to information services. We provide real-time information solutions that leverage the power of the collected data applied to defense, smart cities, public safety, agriculture, and mining. So how can massive data from sensors uh, be visualized with Luciad? Luciad does not preprocess any data. We don't use uh, any database to copy the data to before using it. Lucid can access the data sources directly and bring the data from the sensors in real time. So we use an in-memory approach to achieve that. On top of that, for complex analysis, we use the power of GPU. All of that together makes us a powerful platform to visualize millions of data in real time. So can you give an example of a smart city application that Luciad has built? The city of Quito in Ecuador implemented a system based on Luciad. It covers cadaster, urban mobility, public safety, and public works. It is used, for instance, for the trolley bus public safety. They monitor cameras in real time in the stations. They also have a complete situational awareness of the fleet over the city. It is allowed for the passengers to press a panic button on a mobile application in case a dangerous situation occurs. For the next phase, they're going to implement an early warning system monitoring sensors in underpasses to avoid uh, danger uh, for citizens in case of floods. Most of cities in Latin America lacked of uh, good urban planning in the past, but with these kind of platforms, we are transforming services into digital interoperable services. So how can end users benefit from this application? The municipality has an overall control of the city's performance in all different aspects. They can understand much better how the taxes are collected based on cadastered data, but they can plan the public works uh, in a smarter way using traffic data. They can manage the emergencies uh, in a more efficiently and faster to reduce the impact on the citizens' uh, dangerous. In the end, it's all about uh, optimizing resources and improving the livability of the city for the people. Well, well thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you very uh, much. For more information about today's topic, please log on and visit uh, luciad.com or hexagon.com slash smart cities. Thanks again, Jose. Thank Have a great much. day. Thank, thank you.